Beyonce has been a pinnacle in the African American community for well over a decade. Having the highest paid ad by Pepsi to a recording artist, it's no surprise that this record breaking superstar is so beloved. Here are 8 facts you didn't know about Beyonce. Number 8. Before 2010, Beyonce had an alter ego that she had created to give her confidence during her performances. She created the alter ego Sasha Fierce to let herself be free on stage and get rid of her shy personality while performing. She even released an album in 2008 titled I Am Sasha Fierce. In 2010, she killed off Sasha Fierce. In an interview with Allure, she said, Sasha Fierce is done. I killed her. When asked why she chose to kill off her alter ego that had given her so much confidence, she replied with, I don't need Sasha Fierce anymore because I've grown and now I'm able to merge the two. Speaking about her own personality and Sasha Fierce. Number 7. The Queen isn't a stranger to breaking records. In 2018, she was the first African American woman to headline Coachella, but that's not really a surprise when she is the highest paid African American recording artist of all time. She is the most Grammy nominated woman in history and actually was the first woman to win six Grammys in one night. She was ecstatic, but refused to comment on any of her broken records because she went radio silent in 2013 and has had a strict no interview policy ever since, only breaking it in certain circumstances. Number 6. Beyonce has ever only seriously dated two men. Her ex boyfriend Linda Locke, who she dated for around six years from when she was 13 all the way up to 19 after breaking up with him because he cheated on her. Her other serious relationship was with her now husband rapper Jay-Z, who coincidentally also cheated on her. This time though, Beyonce found it in her heart to forgive him. The couple are still happily married and raising three children, Blue Ivy, Rumi, and Sir Carter. Number 5. In late 2011, the Commonwealth Scientific and Industrial Research Organization announced that a new specimen was going to be named after the pop star. The fly is called Scapta Beyonce, and the researcher who named it did it because the golden hairs on the fly's lower body reminded him of the 2001 hit song Bootylicious. This isn't the first time the artist was part of an academic advancement. In 2004, due to the widespread use of the word bootylicious that she was a direct cause of, it was added into the dictionary. Number 4. Synesthesia is a neurological condition where the senses get mixed up and are processed in more than one way. A person with this condition may be able to see music or even taste colors. Beyonce is part of the small group of people who have this condition. Some other musical artists have this condition, including Kanye West and Frank Ocean. It was a rumor for a long time before she took to Facebook and wrote, I see music. It's more than just what I hear. She continued her post saying, When I'm connected to something, I immediately see a visual or a series of images that are tied to a feeling or an emotion, a memory from my childhood, thoughts about life, my dreams or my fantasies, and they're all connected to the music. No wonder she's so connected to her music. Number 3. In 2013, the pop star released an album and gave iTunes priority for one week, meaning it wouldn't be available anywhere else. As a result, the superstar chain Target refused to carry any copies of her album. A spokesperson said, At Target, we focus on offering our guests a wide assortment of physical CDs. And when a new album is available digitally before it is available physically, it impacts demand and sales projections. Beyonce was understandably angry, so she chose to do her Christmas shopping at Target's competitor Walmart, all the while handing out $50 gift card to other shoppers. Today, Beyonce doesn't harbor any grudges against the chain and was seen shopping there in early 2019. Number 2. In 2004, Beyonce was out shopping in New York City when a group of excited fans tried to rush her. Her bodyguard at the time, who goes by the name of Shorty, tried to defend her, but was pushed back by a group of fans and accidentally stepped on Beyonce's toe, breaking it. An unidentified witness said, There was some fans on his tail and he was too busy watching them to see where he was putting his feet. Beyonce let out a shriek and hobbled back to her car, wincing in pain. She looked angry at first, but then she burst out laughing because you would have thought she had been shot by the way he was reacting. By the way she reacted, it's safe to assume that she harbors no ill will towards Shorty. 
One of Beyonce's friends commented on the incident saying, Beyonce knows that Shorty is there to protect her, and she also knows that he will always do his best to be by her side. Number 1. Beyonce is no stranger to struggle. She had to work her way up to the top. Nevertheless, the pop star loves to give back. She has her own foundation called Be Good and partner up with her former Destiny's Child band member to create the Survivor Foundation. She's raised hundreds of thousands of dollars for charities all around the world, as well as partnering up with Goodwill and Phoenix House. Click the subscribe and notification bell to stay up to date with your favorite celebrities and athletes. Want to see a video about your favorite celebrity or athlete? Drop a comment below and don't forget to hit like.